Hello YouTubers. Well, I had to do something which up until now I have been very reluctant to do. I bought some nitric acid. That's right, the guy with all the videos on YouTube about how to make your own nitric acid went out and bought some acid. Well, you know, that last video I did where I uh, showed how to make uh, a fair, fairly large amount of nitric acid, and I'll put a link to that video up here in the corner uh, and in the description. I thought that acid would last me for a couple months, but I blew through it pretty quickly because I'm doing a series of experiments to see if I can get, you know, more precious metals out of the electronic waste I'm processing than I normally do, see if I can get more gold and more silver out than I usually do. And I've been just going through a lot of acid, doing a lot of experiments. i got some experiments going on over here right now. i got some stuff going in the fume hood over there. Um, and I'm just going through the acid pretty quickly. So I was thinking, I'm going to have to buy some acid. And I looked around online, the usual suppliers, and I'm like, oh, the prices. This is just ridiculous, these prices. Maybe I should... Maybe I should just set up the distillation apparatus, babysit it all day long, and see if I can turn out a couple liters of acid. But then, you know, I was on I was on eBay um, a week or so ago, looking for something, I forget what. And while I was on there, I thought, well, let me look for acid while I'm here. Let me look for nitric acid. And sure enough, there's a lot of people on eBay selling nitric acid, and some of them have really good prices. Uh, this place right here... Nevada City Metals had 70% uh, lab grade nitric acid for, well, it, the, the, the price depends on how many you buy. So I got two, so I got a little bit of a discount. So I paid $25.65 per liter for this nitric acid, which is, you know, just, you know, a couple bucks more per liter than what it costs me to make it, you know, and that, 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 acid video that I put up there I calculated what it was costing me roughly per liter to make it and it was like 2370 so 26 26 65 isn't enough of a difference to to really matter price wise buying it the real painful part is the shipping forty six dollars for hazmat shipping and I knew that was going to be, you know, a problem. That's why, that's one of the reasons I've been reluctant to buy it. But at least the price of the acid is reasonable. Uh, most places, they want, you know, maybe double what uh, Nevada City Metals is asking. And um, so their price is really reasonable. And any place you buy it from, you're going to get hit with the hazmat shipping charge. So it's just no avoiding it. It's just a matter of life. So, um, you know, I have no connection to Nevada City Metals. Never done business with them before, but I have to say, I'm pretty happy with it. Uh, the, their price is really good. They got the stuff to me as quick as they could, considering the shipping restrictions on it. It took took a little over a week to get here, but uh, that's okay. I, I've cracked one of the bottles open, and I'm already using it. It's great acid. It works good. So, you know, no complaints. So... If you need some nitric acid, I can highly recommend these folks. And, you know, look around on eBay. Maybe you'll find an even better deal than these guys. I doubt it, but you might. And uh, I just wanted to let you know that, you know, I'm, I'm buying some acid now. And, um, you know, at the, at the rate I'm using it, I may have to buy more. Once all the experimentation I'm doing is over with, maybe I won't need as much acid. I'll just set up my distillation apparatus every once in a while and make some. You know, once I've got some of the, the kinks ironed out of my process. But right now, I'm experimenting a lot. I'm going through a lot of acid. It's easier for me to buy it and pay the extra for just the convenience of not having to make it. Rather than spending the time to make the reagents needed to get the precious metals out of the electronic waste, you know, I'll just pay for the, the acid and the shipping and use that time to get more precious metals out of the electronic waste. And I think in the long run, the acid will more than pay for itself. At least that's what I'm hoping. We'll see in the long run how it goes. But uh, now I've got so much acid, well, I may have to film some of these, uh, these experiments I'm doing and uh, make some more YouTube videos. We shall see. Anyway, thanks for watching. Give the video a like if so inclined. Uh, subscribe if so inclined. And keep it safe out there. See you next time. Bye.